Hi, welcome to Lunar Logic Tarot. I'm Juju, and this is going to be a general weekly reading for this week in February 2022 for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So please take what resonates, leave the rest. If it's not your story, don't try to make it fit. Roles can be reversed. Um, also keep in mind everything is subject to free will and the will of the divine. No one is free from law of cause and effect. Um, if you would like to get a personal reading with me, all the information will be in the description box below, as well as... Um, all my other social media platforms you can follow me there if you like um oh i just drew a blank are you drawing blanks a lot should i don't know what to say oh please like this video and subscribe to my channel smash that subscribe button okay and hit all notifications that we never miss an upload all right gemini this mercury retrograde is happening right now so i might stumble over my words so it's about to go direct here soon i think it goes direct this week on the third of february so it might be hitting you a little hard okay so let's see what's going on for gemini's in love what's going on for gemini's in love what's going on for gemini in love please clouded insight yeah like i was saying the clouds here might be the one of fire sign aries leo sagittarius but there's something it's like i don't know if you can see it i don't know if you can see it but there's like lightning hitting this tree so it's a shocking revelation here but it's not all clear something isn't clear what else please what's not clear is that someone's juggling you or taking a, an unforeseen risk what else yeah there could be children involved here you could be dealing with a younger air sign, an air sign like yourself, a, another Gemini, a Libra strongly, or an Aquarius here. This talks about new beginnings or children. Someone's risking a new beginning here. What else, please, for Gemini? What else, please, for Gemini? There's an ending to a new beginning here. It could be dealing with a Scorpio. Someone just wants to be single. Yeah, but you're being divinely guided towards something, okay? Possibly to an Aquarius. What is this clouded insight about, Spirit, for my Geminis in love? What is this clouded insight? No hope, no faith of healing, no wish fulfillment. Aquarius energy, the star card reverse. You're not seeing that something isn't a wish fulfillment. Why is the star card reverse? Because there's no balance. Someone brings a lot of chaos to your life. You're not balanced. They're not balanced. And it could be Sagittarius here. Temperance reverse. There's no healing here. Someone's hiding the fact that the, this can't be, this this isn't wish fulfillment and there's no healing. Someone's hiding that. Why is the dice here? Why is this juggling? Why is the dice here? Page of cups reverse. Someone's emotionally immature. Too emotionally immature. It could be a Pisces. Why is the page of cups here reverse? Someone's rejecting offers as well. Or someone is not being sincere in their approach. Why is the Page of Cups reverse? Because of conflict, drama, and rivalry. Someone here is playing a lot of games here. Someone is creating competition on purpose. What is this new beginning about? The Queen of Wands. I feel like this might be you. Or there's a, somebody here wants a new beginning with a Queen of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Very attracted to this person. Very ambitious person. Somebody wants a new beginning with a fire sign. This could be you or this could be them. What is this Queen of Wands? King of Swords Reverse. Someone's lying to you about another woman. The, the Queen of Wands is the other woman card. There is somebody here who's lying to you about wanting a new beginning with another woman. Or ma'am. Show me the King of Swords Reverse. You're going to get clarity about this with the sun. The Six of Pentacles reversed, that is imbalance here, and someone here wants a new beginning with someone else. That's why they're acting this way. I feel like they're acting a certain way. They're acting very aggressive, passive aggressive, maybe even pushy or like irritable. Like I feel irritation. This person is acting irritated with you. Why is there an imbalance here? Six of Pentacles reversed. Is this is this is with someone in the past that they're giving they're investing into someone from their past they're offering love to this person 
offering recovery for somebody from the past to heal a betrayal from the past with this person, this other woman or other man. Why is the ending here? And I feel like your new beginning that you were supposed to have with this person isn't happening because they have somebody else. I feel like, I'm late, sorry. I feel like you were supposed to have a new beginning with somebody. And that new beginning isn't happening. It's a vape, sorry. Because they have somebody else. They have someone else. What is this ending about? Yep. But there's unfinished business with, with this person or with you. Somebody is making a decision. They're going to be dropping you very soon with the lover's card reverse. Show me lover's reverse. You're up in your head about this. You're stuck in your head about this. Now this could have already happened. This person could have dropped you and you wonder why they dropped you. They dropped you because of someone else. They dropped you to go back to someone from their past. Yeah, this person was a player. They created a lot of conflict. They were emotionally manipulating you. Aquarius energy. This person's a player. There's no movement forward with this person. This is why it's ending or why it ended. I get this might be even be past this happened and someone like kind of let like left you out in the cold. They didn't give you a reason why. It's because they had someone else. Yeah, they're making new offers elsewhere. Yep, and you're gonna you were you're gonna you're gonna see this with the sword of truth here. You're gonna have absolute clarity here. You might be the one cutting this person off once you realize what's been going on with this past person. You might be the, actually the one who cuts them off. You know? Let's see. Um, no, let's see. Who you could be dealing with now. This could be sun, moon rising, okay. Taurus, sun, moon rising, Aries. Sun, Moon, Rising, Scorpio, a Virgo. Let's get you some guidance here. Anything else? Anything else? Any guidance, please? You need a big fucking hug. Mm, I'm giving you a hug right now. Big hug. You need a big fucking hug. Squeeze. You need a hug. I love you, Gemini. You're going to be okay. You're going to be okay. Now, these are karma cards. Are these a little harsher? Okay. What guidance do you have for my Geminis? My beautiful and handsome Geminis. Maybe you don't, maybe you don't have any more. Any guidance? Any other guidance? Yep. Crush the competition. Your insecurities are keeping you small. Reconnect with your dreams and aspirations. Yeah. Rebuild yourself. Rebuild yourself, Gemini. You got this, okay? You got this. You got it. Okay? All right. Well, this is what I have for you, Geminis. If you want to get a personal reading with me, the information is in the description box below. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Um, remember, the roles can be reversed. Please let me know if it resonates. Let me know if it doesn't. Roles are reversed, like I said. And uh, yeah, smash that uh, subscribe button. Hit all notifications. That way you never miss an upload. Mwah. I love you guys. Take care of yourself. Until next time. Bye.